Pixel reminded me of a kid I knew growing up. Hey, me again. How can I help? What do you do here? Well, me and my brother and my sister usually live in a tribe way over that way by the old burnt-down radio tower. But it's, like, so boring there. We come here for the action. I can see why. Did a vehicle come through here recently? Maybe. How recently is recently? Like two nights ago? Oh, then definitely no. But wait, two nights ago? My brother, Vauxhall, he saw this giant monster. What kind of monster? Like a totally huge, but not real one. Huge, but not real? I mean, Vauxhall says it's totally huge, and Ember says it's not real. Well, which is it? I don't know what to believe. Who's Vauxhall? My brother, remember? Can I talk to him? I guess, but he's not as friendly or helpful as me. Real question is, will he talk to you? He's been hiding for like two days now. Won't speak to nobody but me. Can you tell me where to find him? Maybe he'll talk to me. Maybe. Yeah, okay. You've done me a favor. He's hiding in a bench in the garden. I told him I wouldn't tell no one, but you seem okay. See you around. Okay, I'll go. Hello, Voxel. Shh. What? My name is Foster. I've just got a few questions. <clears throat> I wanted to ask you if you've seen any monsters. <laughs> How do you know about the monster? Your brother, Pixel. Stupid, stupid Pixel. He's so stupid. Go away. Me again. Can we talk some more? Hi. Voxel, about this monster. Truth is, I'm a monster hunter. I've been tracking a monster across the desert for days. I think he came through here. And I'm looking for someone brave enough to see it and live to tell the tale. Um, I saw it. Can you describe it? It was big and beasty and it eats children and I could hear the screaming and it was fast and dark and silent. Slow down, one thing at a time. It was big, like a giant dog. A giant dog? That sounds like what I'm after. Did you see any children? No, but I heard them. I heard kids crying inside its tummy. And where did it go? It sneaked off into the city. After that, I got in here. No way am I gonna let it get me. You've been in here for two days? Still alive, aren't I? This giant dog, where did you see it? I was playing buzzsaws and dynamos with Pixel. I won, and he was really cross. Then, in the night, I woke up. It was totally dark. I'd heard this sound, like feet padding along the road, big feet. And then I heard screams, children's screams. I ran over here and hid in my fort. And you've been in here ever since? Yeah, I'm hungry. Any ideas on getting into the city? People go in and out of the main gate. Are you gonna go in there and kill it? Sure am. That's what monster hunters do best. 
Then I'm gonna bring Milo and the other children back out. You will? Oh, you better take this. Thanks. What is it? A firecracker. I was gonna use it to kill the monster. But you can have it. Bye. Hey, you got anything to eat? I'm kinda hungry. Uh... I could keep an eye out. Mr. Hopsworth sometimes lets me have some of his lunch. He doesn't usually know that, though. Ah, understood. Voxel's giant dog sounded a lot like the stalker that had taken Milo. Now I was sure that the stalker had entered the city. There had to be a way in through the main gates. were locked shut. Perhaps for the best. This wasn't a job for Braun, and I didn't yet have the brains. Hey, Wendell. Morning, son. Or afternoon. I lose track. So, your truck is full of... mini knockwurst? You betcha. Mini K. Best in the gap. Even contains some real meat. You're welcome to take it on, full. Back of the truck's open, although... the doors like to play silly beggars. Oh? Requires a special technique. Ritual, you could call it. Ritual? Aye. Now listen carefully. Step one, give the bumper a wallop. Step two, do a little jig. Step three, pull the door and jerk it hard. Wallop, jig, pull. That it? That's it, lad. And remember the order. I'll be back. I'll be here. Bumper. These were not my best moves. Come on, big fella. The bird's beak looked especially vicious. I want the bird to mistake my hand for its next meal. I was going to have to think of another solution. Come on, big fella. One particularly large and familiar bird stood out from the rest. The bird's beak looked especially vicious.
Guess what I found? A lot of nerve coming back here. Nope. This. What? My deed? I'll have that. Sure, but... How about I give you the deed in exchange for the citizen ID that's on it? The deed for the ID? But... You wouldn't have it back if it weren't for me. It wouldn't have been stolen if it weren't for you. So we're even. <sighs> I suppose that's sort of... fair. Excellent. When do we start? Have you got a U-chip? Yes. My hand is still stinging. Right then. Let's get this over with, yeah? Pass me back my deed, hmm? I'll need to hook the deed up to my workbench here. Ember's deed had a citizen ID stored on it. 